Hey guys, today I'd like to talk about the best IDE for Rust development. Last year, I compared C Lion and VS Code for C and C++ development, and not surprisingly, these two are the most popular IDEs for Rust as well. The question is, which one is the best? Honestly, they are both great, and I don't think anyone will regret choosing one over the other. But there are some key differences that set them apart, so let's go over these in details one by one. First, the pricing. This is probably the main blocker from people trying out CLion for the first time. Unlike VS Code, which is completely free, CLion is a subscription model that starts at $100 for first year, $80 for the second year, and $60 onwards. Unless you're really serious about developing in Rust, it may be hard to justify paying this money when you have a great alternative like VS Code that is free. Good news though is that JetBrains has been offering their software free for not only students, but also for open source projects core contributors as well. Next question is then, is it worth spending the money for CLion over VS Code? This is a good segue to the second key difference, which is debugging experience. Debugging is probably the most critical features of an IDE, and this is what sets apart an IDE versus a code editor. And this is where CLion really shines. Let me show you concrete examples. Let's say we want to step into fill buff method of buff read trait from the standard library. In VS Code, we simply cannot do this out of the box. Even if we ask to step into the function, the debugger simply refuses to do this. With CLion, on the other hand, I can easily step into standard library function out of the box without any config changes. Another pain point with VS Code is that I cannot inspect the return value from a function during debugging. Say I step into this guns function and then I step out of it. Now I can't inspect its return value in VS Code. Let me repeat the exact same steps with CLion. I can step into the function and step out of it, and here, it shows the return value from the function. Note that this feature only works with GDB and not LLDB at the time of my recording. One last thing I want to compare is how variables are displayed. Here I have a variable called statements, which is a vector of type statement. A statement is defined as an enum type with several variants such as expression, variable, and print. On VS Code, you just can't tell which variant each element of the vector is. Even if you expand each of the element, it still does not tell us what type of variant it is. With CLion, however, the debugger immediately displays which variant type each element is. Here, the first three are variables. The fourth one is expression, and the remaining are all print variants. So we can clearly see that CLion debugger comes with much better features than VS Code. To be fair though, Microsoft does not officially support Rust in VS Code. There is a C, C++ official extension from Microsoft, but there is no such thing for Rust. So we need to rely on Rust extensions developed by the community. For language support, that is Rust Analyzer extension developed by the Rust team. For debugging support, it relies on code LLDB developed by an individual. CLion, on the other hand, has a Rust plugin developed by JetBrains and comes with bundled debuggers for tighter integration. In terms of code editors, both CLion and VS Code are fantastic and provide feature sets that are on par with one another. One prominent feature in VS Code that I wish CLion to have is marking files in red to indicate compilation error. For example, when I make a change to a code here, then VS Code immediately marks all the files that can no longer compile due to this change. This feature is super useful as I can quickly locate the errors and fix them. With CLion, however, I need to explicitly build the project to see all the errors. Likewise, there is also one feature in CLion that I wish VS Code had. Pressing Shift key twice brings up Search Everywhere window, where you can search for literally anything. So, to sum up, both CLion and VS Code are excellent IDEs for developing Rust. CLion is a commercial product with excellent debugging support and its killer Search Everywhere feature. 
VS Code is a free open source software that supports Rust through community-driven effort and yet proves to be more than enough for typical Rust development. Personally, I prefer to write code in VS Code, but when it comes to serious debugging effort, I switch over to CLIN for better productivity. Alright, hopefully this can help you choose the right IDE for you, and I'll see you next time.